Oh, hi. We didn't see you there. Hello. We were too busy reading these shitty books. <laughs> these books that idiots wrote. Welcome to the 500 Open Tabs AMA. Ask me anything. Well, that's what it stands for. <laughs> Are you kidding? I didn't know. You know what AMA stood for? Of course I know what it stands for. It's weird. I have to turn my head to look at you. I was about to get mad. Can you go back to San Jose so Um, I can just see you in the screen? (laughs) He hates me. I hate me. We all hate him and me. That's why you listen to this. You love disasters and train wrecks. Look, here's the thing about us being in person. We feed into each other. It's way more So much worse. AMA. Ask me anything. Attention, mom. Att- uh, attention. attention. <laughs> Mom, Please look at me. Please be proud of me. <laughs> okay. Never going to happen. Breathe, We're breathe. podcasters. Anyway, uh, and so why don't we just go through it and answer some questions? I'll ask the first one. Go for it. It is from Fat Harry Potter. What type of cake would be in your stomach when they exhumed you from the bog? Oh, yellow cake. <laughs> <laughs> what? Just like plain yellow cake? Are you six? <laughs> Yellow cake is part of how they make WMDs. <laughs> and right off the bat, we have WMD talk here. No. What about you? No, that's my answer. I'm sticking Yellow to it. Yellow cake, pound cake. Okay, great. <laughs> Basic. Next question. <laughs> Next question. It's from Jazz. Kaveh, can you ask Hannah? Wait. <laughs> okay, Kaveh. We can, prepped. Can you ask Hannah what are the best and worst kids shows she's had to watch as a parent? Hannah. Yeah. What are the best and worst shows or kids shows you've had to watch as a parent? You you've opened a door, Jazz. <laughs> of course, Bluey's the best. Another one is like anything with a plot. And here's the thing: if you're gonna have kids, plot matters. Doesn't matter what the animation is like as long as there's a plot. Don't That's show them true. Paw Patrol. There's a plot to that, but it's fascist. They're all fascist. The town is run by dogs, police dogs, and some dumb mayor who does literally whatever the police dog says. Things with plots. I love Adventure Time. I love Blue. No, Bluey's uh, duh. Sesame Street. Duh. Anyway. Okay. There it is. Great. Uh, I hate Paw Patrol. If you don't want fascists to be in power, don't let your kids watch Paw Patrol. I mean that. Okay. Uh, Okay. Uh, Anna Vernice asks, uh, do you have a comic strip slash work that first got you interested in the craft? Love y'all. Yep. Yeah. Uh, Matt Groening's Life life is, is it Life in Hell or Life is Hell? Life in Hell, I believe. Life in Hell. I, I always talk about how like oh, there it is that's a, oh yeah right there that's a Matt Groening piece. It 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 was the first comic strip I ever read, uh, and then my dad had all the books. I always talk about this, and it just he had all these books, and I would just be like, Joink, you know, reading these as a, like a six year old, which should explain a lot. Um, but that was the first time I was like, oh, this is awesome. Yeah. And then yeah, what about I, you? I have it still over there. You do I have my uh, big book of hell? Yeah, it's the one. Yeah. My sister got it for me. I think I was like nine. It was too or young. Eight. It was way too way young too for young it. Way too young for it. Yeah, I was. But she was like, "Oh, the Simpsons." Because again, I'm ancient, so it was like it was when the Simpsons were. She was like, yeah. "Oh, here's the thing that the guy from the Simpsons made." And I uh-huh. remember reading it, and I read that thing cover to cover, uh-huh. over and over and over yes. and over again. I didn't know that. So did I. We talked about this. No, we didn't. You don't remember anything. It's fine. I don't either. <laughs> that was a big one, though. Life and Hell. I think for it sounds like for both of oh, us, it, was, it, it doesn't matter. John the Mod asks, "Is there anything that makes some tabs harder for you to close than others?" For me, it's like if I don't, because I'm kind of a completionist, Mm -hmm. if I haven't really like figured out, if I haven't gone down the rabbit holes that I wanted to, Mm -hmm. I I feel the loss when I'm like, wait, there was something in that article that I wanted to read about and now I can't find my way back. Mm. Uh, But then I can open it. But you know, it's just one of those things where it's like, or it's like on the tip of my tongue, I'm like, oh, there's something, you know? And then, or it's when I, I, I think I might buy something. Like I oh, have, I have a lot of those, yeah. Where it's like, oh, I closed the tab. I really, I know I wanted it. I don't remember what it is. Um, yeah. yeah, honestly, it's pretty much same. the same. I don't really have a more interesting answer than that. Okay. Um, <clears throat> uh, okay, from Camille Bailey again. If you were a dragon, what would you hoard? I would hoard dragons. I don't know. More dragons. <laughs> you would hoard more dragons. Next question. I would <laughs> That's it. No, we're leaving that one. <laughs> Licorice Pencil asks, if you could be any type of tree, what tree would you be? A yew tree. What's a yew tree? Y-E-W. They live forever and they flourish in graveyards. 
Which is such a great answer. <laughs> Your turn. I do have this tab open. What's that? What's like the oldest trees or like the biggest oldest oh. trees that are in California? They're like in somewhere. I only in the... know the one in Utah. It's named something and it's like <sighs> what three thousand years old. There's ones in the Greeking middle of the Aspen? desert. No. I actually have a tab oh. open on it. I know oh, you have so many. Tabs. I have a lot of tabs. <laughs> I've never seen somebody else's tabs, dude. Wait, hold on. I'm going to figure this out. I'm going to remember this. Still scrolling. Open a new tab. Because I don't remember what the tree is just called. Put, just put desert tree in California old. It might not even be Oldest the desert. tree in California. No, Bristlecone pine trees. Oh, okay. Let's see. These are the ones Whoa. that are like some of the craziest, <gasps> oldest trees. Oh, those are cool. They're beautiful. Look They're at like, these things. Here, They're flip insane. Flip the camera. Flip the camera. Yeah. Oh, they look like they're old wizards. These are gangster ass trees. Look at these things. Or that. Ooh. This guy, this guy and his roommate don't get along. Uh, he has to clean up his roommate's puke like every day. Uh, Special guest appearance. Oh, Zola! Zola, talk. <laughs> oh, she doesn't want this. Oh, sorry. sorry. Is there anything that one of you does that really irritates slash annoys the other, especially after a long con day? You're not going to... You're not going to like my answer. Yeah. 